Clifford Myers, everyone, give me a hand. Come on, Clifford. Oh, right. I said I want an intro. It's got to be a portion. And I said you got to mention it to make them warm to me. How are you, sir? Good to see you. Well, you're just going to shake my hand. Don't touch me. I am. Uh, like, it is good to be here. Oh, uh, this is good. Thank you. To celebrate, I just survived the first year of marriage. Is that exciting? <laughs> this girl's looking at me like, oh, the homeless man thinks he's loved. He's playing pretend. I'll kill you. <laughs> Got married, man. It's wonderful. Went to uh, Mexico for my honeymoon. Home of the pregnant hooker. <laughs> you guys been in Mexico. It's wonderful. I, I come from, the thing is, okay, I come from like this intense Portuguese family and everyone was coming up and like, give me the warnings about going to Mexico. You guys know the warning? You got a friend going to Mexico. What's the warning? Just yell it out. What's the warning? Don't drink the water. Drink the water. Thank you very much. Now, there's a secondary warning with don't drink the water. Does anyone know the secondary warning? <laughs> Thank you, ice cubes! Cause they're made of water! Come on! My family's intense about this. They're like, when you guys go into Mexico, don't drink the water and don't consume the ice cubes. They're my face, like a witch warning me not to go to the mountain. They're like, when you go to Mexico, don't drink the water. I don't know why my family's doing this, and I'm sorry about your view. But my wife and I, we're on the airplane, and my family's running down the tarmac. Don't drink the water! And don't consume the ice cubes! <laughs> And the first thing they give us is a complimentary glass of ice water. And I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do if the ice was in the water. I thought it was like two positives make a negative. And I've never been good at geography. But anyways, long story short, I uh, shit my pants. Uh, I, got, I did get a lot of perspective when I was in Mexico. I got a lot of perspective. Like, do you ever put yourself in another person's shoes? Like, do you ever think of how weird it would be to be, like, a 12-year-old Mexican girl? You know, that awkward age when all your friends are having kids? Uh, speaking of Snooki, I, uh... I hate that woman, man. She is, okay, she is either incredibly stupid for a human being or incredibly smart for a Cheeto. Right? And everyone thought it was weird that she named her kid Dominic. I'm like, okay, that's not as weird as the devil naming his kid Snooky. Right? But I'm right about everything. Uh, I gotta say, it was nice. I like being married. Uh, I guess I'll get into it. My wife and I have sex. Don't picture it. <laughs> We do. But the other day, my wife and I were getting hot and heavy. <laughs> Mainly heavy. And, and my wife tried something she was horrible at. My wife tried talking dirty to me. Oh, this was a failure. My wife just looks at me, she's like, Oh, Clifford. Your body is a wonderland. I looked at her, I was like, baby. Why is my body a wonderland? And she just looks at me right in the eye. She's just like, because I can't find my way out. <laughs> Come on, that's me! That's me! That, my wife is me! Is it, like, my, my wife's me! My wife calls my dick God because she's not sure if it exists! <laughs> She finally let me do the thing. This is wonderful. You guys know the thing? 
that thing that us guys always want to do and we're never allowed to do it, and when they let us do it, it's awesome. Any guys, yell it out. What's the thing? What's the thing? Just yell it out. Just, come on! What's the thing? What's the thing? You know what the fuck is wrong with you? Say my name! Batman! Now you, you ask me my name! <laughs>